Hey guys, Abs here. I'm going to be taking you through a video demonstration and showing you exactly how to work with feeds and what the settings actually do. Now feed projects are slightly different when comparing them to regular projects and the whole reason behind that is because on regular projects you're actually feeding the description, the title and the links and from feed projects we're actually having an interval of check uh, to go ahead and view that feed and see if there's been any new entries or working with previous entries as well and taking the description and the contents from there um, rather than actually having you input it in here unless of course you're working with the combined feed with article now before confusing you too much I'm gonna actually explain the, the real basics of this and, and the, the only way that I can do this is by having a feed in front of me as well now firstly with a feed um, this is the actual entry so if we have a look at this feed here we can see we've got one two three four we've got four entries in here now on this first entry here it's a link which is the URL to the actual post because this is a WordPress post this is the actual link to wherever the entry is found now this is the actual URL with that URL we've also got the title as well underneath the title we've got the description now some um, feeds have images in the in the description as well now there's there's many things and there's many variations of the feeds um, but we have coded the system to work with feeds so it's gonna pick up on all of this or on all of the tags and all of the images and, and whatever you have in there as well um, but the key thing to keep in mind is when we're talking about or, or when we're when we have um, options and settings such as entry number of entries to combine now we've got to understand that an entry is, is this so if we say we want to combine three entries in one post that means the system's going to work with these three here it's going to take the URL title and description it's going to take the URL title and description as well for all three of them so each post is going to mean each post is going to be based on whatever you have in here so if you only want to post once or if you only want to post one entry at a time keep this on one and that will mean it's going to post the first entry with the title and the URL and the description and the next time it goes and post it's going to post another one entry at a time now if you got huge now the reason we've actually allowed this or or the reason we even thought of combining or combining entries of a feed in each post was because of um, viewing a number of different kinds of feeds and some feeds were massive and you know they had so many entries in there I've actually seen feeds with up to 4,000 entries now if a user wants to work with us fine it, you know um, you can go and create backlinks for them feed entries as well and um, but the only thing is getting through 4,000 entries um, with one entry on each post can be fairly difficult so we've allowed um, the ability to combine up to three entries now the only now the reason I've actually kept it at th three is because I don't think these social media sites are going to really appreciate more than three links um, you know on, on their accounts and uh, you know just to try our best to keep under spam filters um, I think three is going to be like you know the max that we really want to uh, put on any social site and really you know to be honest with you if you can have one um, combined number of entries or two one that's fantastic um, okay and max post now max post what that means is um, how many times you want to post that entry so for example how many times you want to post um, that post now what a post is a post is each time it makes a post of whatever number of entries you've asked it to combine so if you've told if you've set the system here that you want to combine only one entry on each post that means every time it's gonna post this entry so the URL the title and the description to either one of your groups so, so to one of your connections sorry so either ping FM hello text or posterius then that is one post and now it's asking you how many times you want to make that post so if you set this to three what this is doing in what this is saying in essence is take one entry from the feed which is this entry here and post that three times so that's going to go and post it to posterius pixel pipe and ping fm um, that would be three but if you had a group with only one connection it would mean and you only had hello text connected to it it would mean it's going to post that same entry to hello text three times really one is more than enough so I mean you know you can have one in there and I've actually just you know made some notes about this on the support forum as well um, so the max number of posts is actually based on how many times you want to post that entry so if you actually seen duplicates guys that's because you've got this to post duplicate times have this set on one that should be the best um, configuration here unless you want to 
increase your link juice in which case I would say add more connections to your groups as well now combine feed with article that's fairly straightforward um, what that would do is actually take just the URL from the entry and it would add it with an article and with a title and a description from what you enter in here now if you do check this checkbox here it's very important to tell the system whereabouts you want whereabouts you want it to enter the URLs from the entry so you need to enter your your placeholders by right clicking and entering the placeholders now depending on how many entries you've entered in here so if you've told the system okay I want to combine three entries on each post then it's very important that you enter three link placeholders in here as well but that's only if you've entered combined feed with article if you haven't then the description title and the URL is going to be taken as is from here you don't need to enter any links in here you don't need to enter any description in here as well and ignore previous entries guys that's exactly uh, um, it, it does exactly what it says so for example if, you, if I've entered a feed in here now so say for example I entered this feed in here now and it told me I've got four entries if I click if I check this checkbox here that's basically telling the system that I I don't want to post these but I want it to continue to check the feed for new entries should a new entry be found then post that entry and start from there if I leave this unchecked then what the system is going to do is when you go and click start it's going to tell the system it's going to it's going to put these into the queue and start making posts based on your configurations on how many of them entries you want to combine into that post and how many posts you want to make of that of of that post as well so um, I can actually show you this in action now as well let's actually use this feed here okay we can actually update this okay there's my feed URL there and I want to combine I, I don't want to combine any entries I just want to I just want to have the one entry and post in one time um, I'm not going to ignore the previous feeds I want to post these and I'm going to click on save first of all and then I'm going to click on test feed as it tells me that I've got four which is correct I'm going to click on save again so basically um, now I've clicked on save the system's already got a snapshot of the feed now as well if I go back in here and I change around with these settings guys and I click on test one more time then the system's going to again take a snapshot so you don't want to be clicking test again um, if you want to continue with the current process and, and you know the current whereabouts of the feed um, okay so that's saved over I'm going to go to my groups and go to feed I've only got one hello text account in there that's fine um, this is just for a demonstration so, so uh, well you know just to show you how it's done let's say we've got a five second delay now um, the settings is set to 10 minutes so I mean that doesn't matter there uh, at the moment because the 10 minutes will kick in after the queue or the current local copy has been complete because we've already taken a snapshot from here and now if we clicked on ignore previous entries then that would have been fine and the system would have just kicked into the interval of check and started to check every 10 minutes for new entries if we didn't then we're gonna complete the current status of the queue so for here four so I'll show you this now so if we say just say a five second um, delay and I'll click on start posting okay so there we go we're going to hello text and we're logging in first post in progress okay that's been successful and now we're gonna have a timer up here that's gonna count down so as you can see it's counting down from five because we've got a five second delay and if we go over to the right it actually tells you which ones are posting now obviously guys I've only got a five second delay um, not really recommended to be honest you know you want a much larger delay but this is only because I want to get through the current feed queue um, um, now the current feed queue is that okay so as you can see we've got lost season four review okay the countdowns kicked in again at the top there okay now this is all posting to the one account okay that's done now you won't see any countdown on here um, status checking feed now that means it's gonna stay on checking feed until a new entry has been found um, because the local copy of the feed has been complete the system knows when a new entry is gonna gonna be added as well based on the timestamp that we get given um, oops 
So as you can see, that's been complete there. Now, should I have told the system to post two? Should we should we give it a go? I don't mind messing around with this account actually. You know what? Let me click on stop, and we'll give this a go so I can show you this in action. Um, you have to sacrifice some accounts sometimes, don't you? Okay, so let's say two. Okay, two of each, and I'm gonna click on. Okay, let's test feed again. Okay, let's click on save. Let's click on test feed to get a new snapshot. So it's, I haven't ignored the current entries, uh, the previous entries. So that means it's going to take a new snapshot, which is a brand new feed again as it exists because the software doesn't know now. Click on save. This time two posts for each entry, and you'll see duplicates being posted now. Now, by no means am I telling you to do this. I'm just giving you an example of uh, some issues that we actually face today as well. Um, should we do a okay? Let's keep it on a five-second delay. I'm not sure if Hello Text and keeps <laughs> keep allowing us to do this, uh, but let's click on start posting. Oh, okay. All right, let me stop this again. Let me find out what's happening. All right, max posts to test feed save. Now let's try it. Okay, yeah, it hasn't updated the snapshot of that feed. It knows that we've already posted them, you see. Um, okay, what I'm going to do is create another project instead. Okay, let's, uh, let's go here. Let's delete this one. Okay, so that means that's completely gone. Let's add a project. Add that feed there a feed project one entry to combine two posts each um, save it and test it oh <laughs> let's call it test okay and test the feed four entries fantastic make sure that's checked and check the group as well brilliant feed details five second delay start posting okay here we go okay so don't forget we're starting from this one here now I'll keep that one highlighted so we can actually see it so we're on lost season 4 review this time it's started from and the delay we should see that kick in here we go delays kicked in and as you can see we've got another one lost season four episodes as seen on television both the same now let's let let the delay kick in again now obviously if you've got the social hub builder then you can afford to actually waste your accounts um, well you can't really afford to waste your accounts but you're gonna have a number of accounts at your disposal as well okay lost season three four second delay two one and kicked in it should be lost season three again as you can see that's going on and on and on i'm gonna okay no let, let it complete i don't mind getting rid of this account because i've been testing this account for ages now um and then we'll actually go over to the hello text account as well and have a look at that in action and see exactly how it's turned out okay so as you can see what the number of posts does um it's going to double them up or triple them up or, or whatever you actually set them as okay again lost season two episode review okay i'm gonna actually click on stop now um because we don't need to look at it no more um i'm gonna go over to manage groups feed and i'm gonna log into this account give me two moments Okay, so I'm at Hello Text now, and I'm gonna log in to the account. Okay, go to my live stream. If it opens up. Okay, here we go. Fantastic. You can see him here, guys. So lost season two ep um, episode review as seen on television online. Okay, and if we go over to the feed, here we go. Lost season two episode review as seen on T as seen on television online as well. Exactly the oops, where are we gone? 
here we are um, exactly the same title then we're gonna have a link click on that link and we'll take it over to our page obviously that's in a bitly form as well okay and there's a link here and obviously if we have a click on here as well should take us to the same page here we go fantastic Where are we? okay so you can actually see them all in action here um, should we do a should we do another quick test let's do another quick test here um, let's go to I think I'm gonna have to uh, create another project now and I um, right let me just remove this project let me add a new project let me call it a help <laughs> add that feeling here again this time I'm gonna say one post um, but this time we're gonna combine two entries and uh, I'm gonna click on save I'm gonna test feed four entries fantastic save make sure I check that um, and I'm gonna click on start and let's see what happens now <clears throat> okay lost season four review episodes are seen on television Should be on the delay now. Two clicks. Yep. And here we go. Okay. And now this that this should actually stop because we had four entries. We combined two together on each post, so that should be four entries divided by two is two. So that's two posts, and this shouldn't go on a delay. <clears throat> and it hasn't fantastic so I'm gonna click on stop here now anyway and I'm gonna show you what it looks like in hello text now let me refresh this my live stream here we go <clears throat> as you see we've got two bitly links in here now and two bitly links in here now so that means we've got what what we done here in four posts or well, on the first four posts before we done all the duplicates we done in two posts because we combined the entries now if I click on them they're all going to be different pages and different posts we can actually do that now let me click out of this one here so we can see that they're all the correct ones and what we can do is have a look I'm not going to go to them all we can actually have a look at the tabs and look at the titles you can see Lost Season 3 Review, Lost Season 4 Review, Lost Season Episode 1 Review, Lost Season 2 Review. So it's put all the feed in there but in two posts this time. So that's exactly what that does guys. I'm hoping this has given you a better understanding of exactly how this works. Um, I have tried my best to give you real good control um, and there's so many things you can do with this. Um, you will have to use your imagination as well of how you want, into, of how you want to get this done. Um, now I'm going to try my best to get some best practice guides and everything out to you as well um, but it is going to take me a bit of time because I'm working with a development team I'm trying to enhance the software um, I'm trying to make it much more user friendly as well um, now the settings and control and everything you have down here um, just take a bit of time to play around with them even if it means having to mess around and kill an account um, 